I'm here with head cross country coach Dave Risch. Cougars competing in the NACC championships this week in Mequon, Wisconsin. Coach, we'll start with the women's side first. Women finishing in eighth place overall in the conference meet. Senior Miriama Kiesel returned to action and finished 38th overall, 33rd for scoring with a 26 minute and 16 second pace. She's paced the Cougars. Talk about her performance and we'll start with the women and their whole performance. Yeah, Miriamma uh, ran really well for us. Um, she's had to miss uh, many of the meets this year because of a, an abdominal strain. Uh, but she was able to run. She made a few adjustments early on in the race. And um, I thought she ran well for her first race back. And she was our top finisher at, at 38th place. And right behind her was Cynthia Garcia, who's been running really well uh, all season long, too. So those two did a really nice job for us. Um, and I think um, Molly Miklos has done a good job as well. And she had a good race. Uh, as one of our top five runners. And um, Michaela Engel had a, a PR as well. The conditions were really tough on Saturday. There was uh, a pretty moderate rain the whole time and a, a very strong wind, which I wasn't really expecting it to be so windy. But uh, there was probably a 30 mile an hour wind that, that really caused uh, the times to be very slow up. Uh, just looking at all the different teams that were there, I think everybody's times were you know, a minute 20, a minute 30 seconds slower than what they had been running. So um, I kind of figured that that was a factor. And yet we still had quite a few runners who were very close to season best times, which tells me that they, they did step up and as a team, we did run well. Moving over to the men's side, Cougar men finishing in seventh place, led by Josh Warren, who finished first for the Cougars in 33rd overall, then followed by Aaron Boyer. Talk about those men and performing as best as they could in those conditions. Yeah, again, the conditions were tough, and I thought both of those uh, young men, both Josh and Aaron, ran very well for the conditions. And if you think about the time being a minute and a half uh, faster on a, a good day and, and with the course being, if, if the course was dry instead of being completely puddled up and, and tons of mud all over the place. Um, you know, if you take off a minute and a half, then their times were actually uh, close to their season bests. So um, I thought they both ran well. Josh was looking to get into the all-conference and wound up falling short. Um, but I, I know next year he's going to come back with some fire and, and definitely be all-conference. Cougars going to the Midwest Regionals on November 14th. This meet will be hosted by August Stan in Rock Island. Cougars have been there before, Coach. Talk a little bit about how you guys are going to prepare and talk a little bit about how the course sets up for your team. It's a great course. Um, of all the courses that we run, uh, this might be the fastest course. And so we are hoping to uh, finish off the season with, um, at least for almost everybody, with a, a lot of PRs, uh, certainly season bests and hopefully all time PRs. And uh, if the weather's good, the course is good, and um, with the training and everything kind of pointing towards uh, peaking at that point, I think we can have a really good race and do really well. What kind of training do you guys have set up? You guys don't perform for another week and a half or so before you can head to Augustana. How do you keep these kids ready to go and perform at their peak next week? Well, that's the million dollar question. And uh, after coaching for 20 years, I've kind of figured out some things. Uh, I try things different each year because the training really needs to be individually based um, rather than just throwing out one workout and everybody has to conform to it. We want to make sure that everybody is getting what they need to help them to peak at the right time. So this time of year, it's tricky because um, while this week looks like a beautiful week, a lot of times we can get some really cold, nasty weather this time of year. And it gets dark early, too. So, uh, you know, we're fighting those factors, but uh, we will have them ready to run. We will have them ready to run their best. And we're going to have a lot of PRs at last meet. Awesome, Coach. I'd like to thank you for your time, for coming in today. Good luck in the regional. Look forward to talking to you about hopefully some PRs and all-time good results for the Cougars. Thanks a lot. Let's go Cougars.